Maybe it's just from the color. Maybe neutral bio, you should call it exotic green apple. <coughs> <laughs> and then have a hot chick on the like the cover of it. I think that would be Yeah. Welcome to Price File. What? Which one did you get? Uh, I got the sweet tea. Oh, yes, that's I got the, the sweet one tea. I wanted. All right. What's going on, YouTube? Price Plow Nation and Nutribio Nation. This is Mike and CJ here with Price Plow. And we need some caffeine. I want to start the day off right because we got the new Natural Series pre workout from Nutribio in. Long time coming. We, uh, we talked to them at the, at the 2018 Arnold Sports Festival. We did. We actually had a long podcast. Yeah, it so was fun. That we'll was linked to that. Yeah, and that was the initial flavor testing. But we, so for the pre workout, we did the green apple here. Yes. And we have not had the sweet tea pre-workout. No, actually, uh, I want to say I have not had sweet tea at all right. from them. Like that not was... Intrablast, not their regular, nothing. Like I've never had sweet tea. Okay, cool. Well, you did at the Arnold. You had a little was, that, that was, was that? That was Intrablast. Intrablast sweet tea. Right. Okay. Okay, yeah. cool. So yeah, I don't know. Is this, a, this isn't a full review here. We're going to do a flavor tasting of the new Natural Series Pre, and we're going to kind of talk about that a little bit, I guess. Yeah, absolutely. Well, I, I think that we definitely want to do a full review, so what I'm probably going to do is just tack on the end of this, like my experience on it. Okay, right. So I will definitely run this for a little bit. and just, just at least a, a full dose of beta alanine in here. I know, so I know. I thought I was going to be the one running this, to be honest. <laughs> well, here's it, guys. Uh, you know, yes, am I the beta alanine hater? Absolutely. But I can keep it objective. I mean, I, I, I get that, you know, there, there are a lot of folks out there that doesn't mm -hmm. bother so and plus uh if i eat some carbs with it it's not so bad right so. yeah that blunts it a little bit so in general uh this is the exact same formula as the regular pre and mm -hmm. actually behind you over there we have the pre stim free if that one we do yeah, we don't want that. We want the we want the stems right now. Right? I want the stems right now. Right. And so this is like a fully loaded formula. And the issue is that when companies try to do a fully loaded formula with like this with stevia, it turns into a big old after tasty bitter mess. Right. And that's what Nutribio was like. No, we're not going to do that. And so. I can tell you right off the bat that I love the green apple, the one that we had at the Arnold. And so I'm not sure if that that wasn't the the, the production run though. That was like I think that was what they were planning on being the production run. So right. this is the one that actually came off the press. This is the one that you'd be buying. And so I literally I, got this in the mail yesterday, guys. So I mean, this is hot off the press. Man. Right, it's gonna be super fresh and everything. So I wanna, yeah, I wanna give it a taste test. We've done a lot of videos on Nutribio's pre-workout and everything. So you can go back where we analyze the ingredients, we're talking about it. Mm -hmm. We'll link back to some of those. So I don't, honestly, this thing's loaded. It's 35.2 grams of product. I'm not going to go through <laughs> analyzing all the ingredients, but you have like a full blend of stimulants, a full blend of focus ingredients. You have a full blend of pump ingredients. There's, it's everything. Basically You're, anything in here is going to be clinically dosed or over the clinical recommended yes. dose. So this is, uh, it, look, most of you guys watching this, ha you know our thoughts on Nutribio and you probably have studied up on Nutribio at this point. Mm -hmm. Fact of the matter is these guys, it's, it's all about quality control and giving you heavy legit dosing. And so uh, that's going to be the same thing here. Y'all look at the other review to kind of see the details. This is basically that, but a more natural version of it with Stevia. Right. And so, yeah, let's talk about what's different here. First off, uh, one thing that isn't always pointed out is that they moved to their caffeine source to pure calf, which is a natural caffeine source that I believe is derived from like uh, green coffee beans. Okay. And so that is providing 250 milligrams of caffeine. And then they kept the Infinergy Dicaffeine Melee. So you have a total result of 350 milligrams of caffeine. Now, the thing is, um, the, the other time we've seen pure calf was with caged muscles pre-caged. Right. Another big, big formula. Yeah. And, uh, there's, it seems like it's an easier, smoother kind of caffeine than just a straight up anhydrous, in, in my opinion. And that's kind of what Cage Muscle is kind of telling us about too. So I'm interested to see how that how that works out for us right now. Because, uh, you know, 350 milligrams of caffeine, I kind of would like it to be eased out. And that's kind of the plan right. with, with at least having the Infinergy mixed in. Right. So that's, that's the first thing. Now with the flavoring, there's where they have to do well, a little bit of work. I was going to say, you're also having, just, just to throw this out there, you're also having theanine in there as yes. well. So that's something, speaking of the smoothing out effect, that's just something to remember that. Definitely. And so it's a high dose of that too. That's an expensive ingredient, 300 milligrams right there. And so right. I, I typically like a two to one caffeine to theanine ratio, but um, I've, I, with, there's also like bonus stimulants in here as well. So that helps. I, my thing bonus. is I like to have more caffeine than theanine. That's pretty right. much where I've been landing lately. And since becoming a sleep deprived father, for whatever reason, I like the ingredient like 10 times more. I don't, I, yeah. it, it, it calms me a little bit. And you know, we've had some frazzled days and everything. And so that, that once <laughs> nice. in a while taking theanine with the caffeine keeps me like 
even keel. Cool. So we can expect that this be being definitely a more smooth energy product. Right. Yeah. yeah. If you see 350 megs of caffeine, I wouldn't be too afraid. So here's the other the other differences. And as always, Nutribio's full full disclosure with the flavoring. Now they are adding five grams of raw cane sugar to make this happen. I think that's where um, you know that's where there may be some debate. You know, this isn't a pure stevia sweeten. It is a raw organic cane sugar uh, being used. But the thing is, like, so you have five grams of carbs right here on the label. I don't have any problems taking carbs before working out. That's the, honestly, time, that's the one time I like taking my carbs. Yeah, honestly, I, I personally, I think, look, I, I, you know my thoughts on the all natural crowd out there. And the truth is, is that I find it a little bit uh, hypocritical that how, how, you know, hard on some forms of sugar that they are sometimes, mm -hmm. because the fact of the matter is that sugar is, a naturally occurring thing. I right. mean, we see that in, in fruits, we see that in certain types of vegetables and things. I mean, a natural cane sugar doesn't take away from that concept. Now, again, if your problem is, is that, oh, it's adding calories, but guys, five, five grams of carbohydrates is, is it's meaningless in the grand right. scheme of things. You should be burning through that during your warm, your warm right. up. So then there's not a problem there. I just, I just love that you get to see how much is in here. They, they just say natural flavors, 1.15 grams. So that might be where my secret for them is still semi secret. Uh, but they they'll tell you the citric acid, you got a gram. Now stevia leaf extract, 345 milligrams of stevia. I, I don't know. Cause I no, one else, like, no yeah. one else discloses this stuff right. except for maybe transparent labs. And I haven't looked at that label. Um, hmm. It's probably about the same. But I do remember though that the sucralose was around 220 milligrams. Gotcha. So you probably need a little bit more stevia, but then to take off some of that bitterness, uh, at least on the intrablast, okay, it's not here. On the intrablast, they also added salt to, yeah. to knock some of that out. And then the colors are also natural as well. The, uh, yeah, they use like a mixture of, of spirulina and uh, turmeric or curcumin to make the green for yeah. this one. Now, I, I don't know how, if that's a lot of stevia or not, but I just, just kind of my thought process around this is, uh, number one, with stimulant products in general, the flavoring, you know, it's, yeah. it's, it's something you got to cover up certain stem product flavors, especially something like this, where you've got a heavy scoop full of tons of actives, mm -hmm. uh, you, you got to mask it somehow. And so, you know, that, that cane sugar is going to play a role there, but also like you would imagine that they would have to go kind of aggressive on stevia. Yeah. So, right. But too we'll much. See. And so the, the, the question is, you're going to get that bitter aftertaste. That's why I want to weigh it out right now. Let's do a full, a full tub weighing. Okay. Make sure NutriBio is always on point. I don't know if we've ever really, uh, tested them on that. Have we? Uh, yeah, I'm not sure we have. Yeah. It's and, been a while, but okay. yeah, let's do, let's do a full, a full weigh out and then let's give it a taste. All right. Sounds good. Now, Mike, does that count as a scoop on top right there, that's man? That's a scoop on top as far as I'm concerned. And for us, doing the way out, that pillow pack on top is nice and easy, too. Oh, man, that's a full scoop right there. They got these nice thick scoops. Yeah, huge there. scooper. All right. All right, guys, we are going to take the entire weight of this product and make sure that we're getting all of our servings. I know some of you guys in the past have been critical because this is uh, not the cheapest product out there. And so I know you would be upset if you were short a scoop. Yeah, we are looking for, what does it say? Oh my God, I tasted some of that powder. It's so good. 704 grams. 704 grams. Are a touch short. Rut row. So now, in the grand scheme of things, that's like what is that? A, a, a tenth of not a tenth of a scoop. Yeah, it's not. I mean, Six, it's, it's a fifth of a scoop that we are a seventh of a scoop that we're down. Yeah, so not not too terrible. Yeah. All right, now we're gonna weigh out a scoop weight. Uh, these are big scoops. Thirty-five point two one. Thirty-five point two one. We're gonna make sure and get a nice level scoop here. Uh, this is pretty general powder, so not too fluffy, not Pretty nice. close, yeah, we can go a little at minor heaping. That's going to be tough to get perfect, but... Yeah, this is that micro-dosing scale. Oh, look at that, that's... Okay, so just a dash of a, of a heap. Yeah, not bad, Dude, not I'm bad. I'm telling you right now, this green apple smells so good. Which one are you going to want to drink? Tea. <laughs>
right, we're starting off with the tea one. Um, I can tell you right off the bat, I loved the smell of the green apple. Yeah. And then you open up the tea one, and same same deal there. Definitely a lemon uh, type tea. So. And they tell you, they put in like 800 milligrams of lemon extract in each one. So You also smell the uh, kind of earthiness a little bit, I would say, like that little bit of uh, tea leaf. I get, I, I'm getting mostly lemon. Really? Here. Yeah. All right, Let's here do we it. go. I, you know, okay, so the other sweet tea, I can tell it's the same flavor system as the sweet tea from Intrablast. I do like the Intrablast better. Yeah, oh yeah. The, the stems are coming through still a little bit here. You know, honestly, I find this to be enjoyable. Now, in, enjoyable in a different way though. Like, this is not your common, like, sweet pre-workout. Uh, this is... Right. I don't know, man. It, it's It's like if you were... If you were to make like unsweetened tea, you know what I mean, and and just if you enjoy that kind of earthy, leafy type of taste, yeah. I feel like that's coming through. It's closer to an unsweetened tea than it is right. to an overly like crazy Lipton whatever the kids are drinking these days. Right. <laughs> but um, I you know, for me my, and my personal, I'm not a huge fan of lemon. Mm -hmm. There's a bit too much lemon in this for me. Right. But if if you like a lemon you're kind getting, of getting tea, the lips. Are you already getting the beta alanine lips? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I, yeah, if, if you don't like lemon, then that's something you got to think about. Um, also, another strange thing for me, and I guess this is where I'm a little bit torn, is as much as I love tea, uh, tea for my pre-workout uh, doesn't 100% jive with me. Intrablast, yeah, I can see I, that. It uh, works for me in Intrablast. Yeah, pre-workout, I don't know. It's... Yeah, it just seems it seems a little strange for me. I don't know why, but uh, but yeah, I mean, like I said, not not bad. Impressive that this is a stevia sweetened product, by the way. Agreed. Yeah, so. absolutely. And I just got <laughs> just got like a tingle right here. Uh, and the thing is, no bitter aftertaste. I'm sitting here talking. I don't have any problems going on like I would mm -hmm. with other products, and uh, and so that's kind of been eliminated there. And so I'm happy about that. And I keep catching myself wanting to drink more. So there's like that addictive yeah. quality that I get out of some of these flavors, and it does have that. Well. Let's uh, let's try this now. We we have already tasted the green apple before, though, right? This is the one we had yes. at the Arnold. Yeah. Okay. So and I honestly thought to revisit it. Yeah. I and look how like, yours is getting brighter over time. Oh yeah, that's the natural. Color that's natural colors. Yeah, yeah, that's nuts, man. Nice. No need for the fake stuff. <sighs> Looks like straight up like Nickelodeon green. <laughs> it's good. It's definitely this is definitely better than the tea, man. I mean, I gotta say. I'd, I'd be all over this one. I, I've always loved Nutribio's, you know, I have to cough. <clears throat> I've always loved Nutribio's green apple flavor. Right. And whatever they did, they stepped it up another notch. Somehow they made it better, even though they like hamstrung themselves with the stevia. I've, I've always loved their green apple. <laughs> <laughs> and as I'm not coughing, I, I noticed that I was like, had a cough right before I took a um. sip. This is incredible, guys. So, you know what's funny? When we were at the Arnold, now look, keep in mind, we it was a crazy busy weekend. Like, I, by the time we sat down for that podcast, that was basically the last thing that we did. I was just beat to crap, man. Mm -hmm. Like, just exhausted. And uh, truth of the matter is, I, you know, I did do the tasting. I don't feel like I, I enjoyed it as much as I should have. And it was just like, like maybe that moment, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Going back and revisiting it now, though, this is good. I'm I'm yeah. super impressed. I, I wish I would have paid more attention then. Mm -hmm. uh, but this is this is really freaking good, guys. That 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 tea is okay. This is amazing. Well, I'm drinking out of the out of the full shaker. I gave I gave you too much, man. <laughs> but yeah, and you know, as much as I hate to admit it, sometimes color does affect taste. And like there's mm -hmm. a whole there's mental studies on that oh, and yeah. everything. And and that's why I I don't like artificial colors, but I do like when they put the natural colors in. There's something a little extra on top, a little extra exotic on top of this green apple for me. It's not just green apple. I, I, I would never be able to identify it. Maybe it's just from the color. Maybe Nutribio, you should call it exotic green apple. <coughs> <laughs> and then have a hot chick on the like the cover of it. I think that would be... Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's not going to be hot chicks on these tubs. Ah, damn it. Oh, CJ's trying so hard. Ben, I need you to take a note from no, my, I'm giving no, no. you marketing ideas. No, so, I mean the people that are the people that are buying this kind of stuff, I think they're going to be really proud you don't of this. Think but a, like a, like a busty lady that says all natural across, you know, like that would be a all, Oh, the natural series. Oh, but boom. <laughs> all right, so oh. uh, look, all in all, this has been this is really good, guys. I, I honestly am incredibly impressed with this natural series so far. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take this for my next few workouts, uh, and then I'm just going to close out this review uh, so you guys kind of know my subjective experience. 
Um, but I, I really have no doubt. I love the original pre. I have no doubt I'm gonna love this. Um, mm -hmm. You know, flavors are there. I, what what else to say, dude? Yeah, the, I mean, the only drawback was that we lost one seventh of a scoop. That was, <laughs> and yeah, and, and, and Nutribio, you guys are in a unique category because uh, when we have manufacturing issues, that's on you too. <laughs> right? Yeah, I mean, yeah, a lot of times you're gonna be like, oh yeah, blame the manufacturer, get your manufacturing on point. Well, this time it was done at Nutribio. Am I butt hurt over a seventh of a scoop? Absolutely not. But hey, you know what? I'd rather have an extra seventh of a oh, scoop. So we, we got products for free so oh, yeah, we can't we be did. too mad <laughs> <laughs> we did, hey no 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 we do have to say that actually that these were shipped for free yeah and that we try to have unbiased reviews my unbiased review is that this green apple flavor is better than the original and and i like it a lot better than the sweet tea so i'm assuming you're going to be the taking this the green apple one aren't you uh you know what i'm i can take it on the head i can go with the tea <laughs> Well, whoever's going to do the bigger part of the review gets gets the green apple. Green All apple's right. way to go, folks. See you guys in a second. Ooh, what you got there, CJ? We're back. Back with Nutribio Pre, guys. All right, so um, look, you saw the video. This is an amazing product. What are we going to say negative about it, really? I mean, Nutribio, uh, these are the guys that continue to wow us. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, it, it takes a lot for somebody to go. I have literally had conversations with Nutribio where I've said, guys, Maybe that's almost too much transparency. <laughs> and and that, that's bizarre coming from me. Um, but look, guys, this was a great product. Um, now, this is the Natural Series. And the fact of the matter is, I'm not necessarily the target demographic for the Natural Series. Um, I have some Nutribio Regular Pre over here. That's probably going to be my normal go-to. Mm -hmm. uh, just because I don't have a problem with sucralose or, or other you know, sweeteners or not being completely natural. With that said, I found this to be so... Uh, paralleled to that product right. i mean so closely related to that product that if you are a natural individual why not pick it up because it, it's just it's just as good really um i would say the flavors maybe 10 percent lower for me mm. than the than the og but it's it's still like so close that if you were a, a, a stevia person go for it right so. so to me i did a couple workouts with the sweet tea one and i was kind of jealous of you having this i knew that you were the, the one that was going to do this yeah. Um, I'll send it with you, man. All oh, right. Yeah. Honestly, I like the sweet. I, I like the green tea so much. Ugh, I like the green apple so much more mm -hmm. than the sweet tea. Sweet tea Intra Blast, I loved. Sweet tea pre. I just don't look forward to drinking lemon tea before sure. my workout. I've been also like training er really early in the morning, yeah. and it wasn't it wasn't working for me as much for whatever reason. I missed that flavor, and I was like that weird extra something something that's in there i i missed and so without a doubt i'm all about this product but i'm all about it in the green apple flavor for me i think if you want to mess around with a stevia sweetened sweet tea kind of supplement it's got to be the intra blast uh the, yeah the, the pre just isn't my it's just not my speed yeah guys it's consistent it's uh it gives you energy i have great pumps on it uh it, it i i'm comfortable this is something i've said in the past when i take a Nutribio product I have comfort that I am getting everything that I need. Do you have and comfort in the beta alanine tingles? I do. I do. <laughs> uh, look, honestly, I, it doesn't. It, it's one of those things where I, I expect it going into it, and, and mm -hmm. it hasn't bothered me. I just I love the fact that whenever I grab my supplement, I don't have to worry about was there enough of this or that. Right. I mean, yeah. I know that there's everything in here. Um, you got to accept that you are going to pay a little bit more for a product like this, but it's also a product that doesn't have any holes in it. So. You know, takes that for whatever it exactly. is. Exactly. I'm not sitting there like a mad scientist tinkering with, did I get my three grams of creatine or did I, you know, I mean, like, it's done. Yeah, it's not like I can afford a bunch of... <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, you guys check out the Nutribio Naturals line. Uh, we have more coming up. Uh, you know, th th this is just a really good series that, that's going on with Nutribio. And uh, also, if you are not familiar with Nutribio products, uh, we're going to have links down below where you can mm -hmm. check out some more of their products and check, you know, just shop around. Uh, we have see some what coupons. They've got. Yeah, we have a few coupons through some of the retailers, which now, by the time we finish this video, now have this in stock. So uh, check out those deals. Yep. All right, guys, we'll see you on the next one. Be sure to subscribe to the channel. Thank you. Pricefile.com slash Nutribio. Welcome to Pricefile. <laughs>